All right guys, good morning. This is Brad with Texas Bread. We are heading out striper fishing. We're here on Lake Whitney and a buddy of mine invited me, invited me and my wife out, go out uh, with a striper guide. I've never been with a guide on Whitney. I fish here a whole lot and uh, we basically drag umbrellas. I've never really came to Whitney and just uh, drop live bait. We don't fish with, uh, I hadn't, hadn't really ever fished a live bait on Whitney for striper, so that is what we're doing this morning, and uh, we'll see you on the boat. What's the company? What's your strapper guy company? I'm Ron Rogers, strapper guy service, but I also work for Corey. So. Oh, okay. It is not on. <laughs> Did you? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, it's about to get real. <laughs> Today, Whiskey Wednesday? It's actually I thought like... so. We're pretending like it's Wednesday. <laughs> All right, guys, with that rope going over the water, you're going to grab right here in front of the reel and just lift straight up. No reason to jerk or set the hook or anything, just pick it up and reel once that rod tips the boat over. Kelly, thirsty, thirsty. Thirsty. I've got 7 <laughs> I think it's getting like towards 8 pounds. Good line moving in. Oh, oh I caught. Yay. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> little petrified wood. A fish stick. <laughs> really? I think I got an 8 pounder. Yeah, keep that and we can burn it later. We, we had a ton of fish in our freezer. We knew about three families that were really struggling. We gave away 20 bags of fish last week. Oh, wow. Oh, that's awesome. Just, uh, you know, anything helps. Sure. That's a baby. 
bank. <laughs> oh, it's like a tall line, dude. Maybe kind of healthy, maybe. No, yeah, yeah, definitely. Oh. My hand is getting loose. No, it was stripping line. Hello. Oh. Get it, Kelly? No, nope. I'm good fish. Internet TVs. Oh, They're jet skis. Yeah. Iron board fruit system. Yes. All right, guys. So we went striper fishing yesterday. Caught a bunch of hogs today, and I just got done cleaning them up. So now I am cooking dinner for the catch, clean, and cook on the striper. I'm trying a new recipe. The guide that I went hunt or went fishing with. This is how he cooks all his striper. So I gave him my recipe for uh, for lobster, poor man's lobster with striper. But anyways. We're doing fried striper tonight, and it's Frank's red hot, red hot wing sauce is what he told me to marinate them in. He said it's one of the only wing sauces that will actually get into the, the fish. The rest of them just kind of sit on top of the striper. It doesn't actually get into the meat. He said he's had a lot of luck with Frank's red, red hot wing sauce. So that's what I marinated them in. They've been marinating for about an hour, and I'm just going to dip them in some cornmeal right here. So. Once, uh, once I get the cornmeal and my grease gets hot, we are gonna have some fried striper. What'd you think of the fish? It's good. And you liked it? I do like it. Would you do it again this way? Yeah. All right, guys. So it was very good. Um, that's a good. That's a good recipe. I've never done it this way before. Frank's hot, uh, red hot wing sauce. That's what I marinate them in, and I battered them with uh, regular old cornmeal, fried them up, and man, it's got very, very good flavor. Really enjoy this. That's uh, one of the better ways I've ever cooked striper for sure. So. All right, guys. Well, that's gonna wrap this video up. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you try this recipe. Throw me a comment if you've ever done it before. And thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Give me that thumbs up. We'll see you on the next one.